visit the website www.tin-nsdl.com under quick links click on online pan services click on paperless pan application on selecting desired option you will see a form where you need to register and generate a token this step acts as a prerequisite for all types of pan applications here for application type select option new pan indian citizen form 49a from the drop down select appropriate category and title from the drop down list enter last name or surname enter first name and enter middle name do what are guidelines regarding name field select date of birth from drop down or enter details enter the email id and mobile number check the consent check box by doing so you agree that data submitted by you will be used for the purpose of pan application enter the captcha code and click on submit on successful registration token number will be generated same will be sent at the email id of the applicant click on continue with pan application here select mode of application as submit scan images through e sign similarly select between yes or no for whether physical pan card is required here remember that if you select no then you will receive only digitally signed e pan at the email id given in your application enter last four digits of the aadhar carefully enter the name exactly as it appears on aadhar data captured on the registration page before generation of token will be auto populated select the gender from the drop down list under parent details section provide father's name here kindly note that father's name is mandatory and mother's name is optional however for cases where mother is a single parent user can select single parent flag if this flag is selected then mother's name becomes mandatory and is also printed on card please make sure that your father's name or mother's name is correctly entered under contact details select source of income enter communication address what are guidelines on source of income and selection of address under telephone number and email id details select country code from the drop down enter area or std code telephone and email id fields will be auto filled after this you will be navigated to ao code that is assessing officer code section select state and city from the drop down based on selection relevant list of ao codes will be populated select your ao code from the list based on available information and click next after this you will be navigated to document details section select proof of identity proof of address and proof of date of birth from available options for declaration select himself or herself from drop down enter number of documents enclosed enter the place for upload photo and signature section kindly see to it that photo fulfills the acceptance norms for photograph please remember that only jpg extension photograph is accepted the photograph should not have dpi more than 200 the file size should not be more than 50 kb and dimensions of photograph should be 2.5 cm in width and 3.5 cm in height similarly for signature kindly remember that only jpg extension signature is accepted the signature should not have dpi more than 200 the file size should not be more than 50 kb and dimensions of signature should be 4.5 cm in width and 2 cm in height after successful upload 
your photo and signature will appear in the box. For upload supporting documents section, again see to it that documents fulfill the acceptance norms. For documents, please remember that only PDF documents will be accepted and the document size should not exceed 300 KB. Depending upon the options selected for proof, you can add the supporting documents by clicking Add Document button. Once done, click on Submit. On successful submission of details, you will be navigated to Confirmation screen. On the Confirmation screen, you will be required to enter first 8 digits of Aadhaar and confirm details. For editing, select Edit button and you will be redirected to application pages for correcting details. Else, click Next and you will be redirected to Payment Gateway for making payment of application fees using various online payment options. On successful payment, you will be navigated to Authentication Portal. Click on Consent checkbox for providing consent for using Aadhaar details for the purpose of PAN application. Then proceed for eKYC authentication. On successful authentication, you will be navigated to eSign portal for digital signing of application. You will be required to re-enter same Aadhaar and provide consent for e-signing PAN application. Proceed for OTP authentication. On successful authentication, application will be digitally signed and digitally signed PDF will be displayed online. So, apply for PAN now from Protean Online Portal.